What's up, man? How you doing? Hey. I'm Thomas. I'm John. Nice to meet you. Hey, I got a bunch of food. Um, yeah, so I got some stuff in here. It's like some snacks and like a couple bottles of water. Uh, that'd be great. And that um, stuff too? Yeah, that's right. I mean, if we got this gas station dropped off, so I can get... Yeah, yeah, you need to go to the gas station? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, 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 sure, no Dude, problem. This is awesome. I'll, I'll take on. Yeah, there's some, there's some stew in here. So oh, it's hot. So. Actually, I'll go inside and sit in the subway and get some comfort in the air conditioning. Cool, man. Yeah, I could give you a ride. I'm going to give him a ride to the gas station. I'm going to use the phone up there, see if I can get a one friend. Give me a ride too later. Sounds good. Yeah, I see you out here all the time, man. Yeah, somebody's messing with my tents. I got two tents right up here between these bridges. Yeah. And every time I leave, um, you know, I sleep out here like three, four nights a week, and then I sleep at my friend's house a few nights a week. And when I'm not out here, they they cut one tent. I duct taped it up. The other tent, they came, they took off the tarp, ripped a hole in the screen. Out here? Yeah. And then then broke my um, rod. So I duct taped it all, fixed it. I came back today, and they got another slice in it. And I'm like, what the heck, you know? And really? They, they've taken some of my food, like 20 bags of combos. And it's like, wow. Oh, man, man. that sucks. <laughs> I don't know who I made mad or what, man. It's like, you cut your hand? Yeah, yeah, it's all infected. I can show you a little bit of it. It's, uh, Ooh. it's nasty. Ooh, what happened, man? Yeah, it got, I got a cut. Kind of, it had, like, wood splinter, and it picked it out. But it, it got all puffy and infected. So I went in and they, they, they strained it, got, got, got the wood out, and I wow. guess, you know, I'm glad, okay, I didn't get blood poisoning, but... Are you, from, are you from Florida, or are you... I was born in Illinois, I moved out to Colorado, moved down here in 93, and then back and forth 11 times since. Gotcha. Uh, divorced in 04, and been down here solid since. Mom passed away in 08, dad passed away in 01. Yeah. And, uh, Sorry to hear that. But um, I got in the car wreck and you know, I got the cage in my back and I'm trying to get the disability. And once I get the disability, I'll have a permanent income again because I worked my whole life and then, you know, and then I got my back's all messed up. And, and that's what got you here? Yeah, and, and um, you know, so it's, nobody wants to give me my jobs back. They're scared to hire me. And I'm not supposed to lift more than 10 pounds. So I filed right. for disability and got a lawyer. All right. Well, hopefully you can leave it somewhere that you um, don't Yeah, know. yeah, I know. I mean, I'm afraid to leave anything in my tent anymore. Though. I don't want yeah, well, to take it, you know. Yeah, well, but, um, thank you, buddy. Yeah, man. All right. God yeah, bless you. Have a good one, John. All right, thank you. I'll see you around, man. Again? Thomas. Thomas. Yeah. Thanks, Thomas. Yeah, have a good one, man. Everyone relax. Okay. So we're going down to the Palm Beach Improv, the world famous Palm Beach Improv, to see our good buddy Philip Hismay perform. He's a comedian, and I'm gonna heckle the shit out of him. No, I'm not. I'm not really gonna do that. You roast me. I'm not quick on my feet. <laughs> Crystal's with us. Hey. We're in her car. Oh yeah, I'm driving Crystal's car. Okay. So Phil, uh, he needs 10 people to say his name at the door in order to be able to perform. Isn't that fucking weird? Why is it so dark? What would you guys do if I was like a special guest and I got up on stage and started doing stand-up? Really ha! Ha! Huh. <laughs> boo! Boo! I, I don't know. White what, guys can't joke, though. No. I, I don't know. I think white, white guys are really good at joking about masturbation. I know. He's already smiling. I smile so all the time. What's up? My name is Philip Eesmay. Speak. 
I'm speaking. The fuck? Louder. Mike. Nigga, I'm in West Palm Black. You trying to get my ass shot on the news? <laughs> I'm people coming for sure. You guys be on the shoes. You already know Papi Negro, I hope you though. Why yeah, well, you making me look bad? Look at these fucking pieces of shit. Well, you know, it's all about the culture. We were raised different. That's all I gotta. Yeah. Was... Round two? Let's keep clapping it up right now for your next comedian, Mr. Philip Ismay. <laughs> I work, 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 work. His butterfly got the hot 40, I'll fuck with him. If you Haitian, I try to flirt with Claudia, I sound like an African safari guy, you know? I know they be me shield. You, know? you and this pause in their life. Now you probably think I'm trying to get a green card out your ass, and I'm just trying to flirt. My God, what a, what a show. Thank you for coming out, Tommy. So we just got done with the show. I had a really awkward goodbye with uh with Phil. He was talking to some girl. Phil! Up, sorry to interrupt. I gotta go. You going? I'm seeing a documentary about him. It, it's about a comedian. I'm being serious. Yes. I can't see anything right now. Hold on. I'll see you on the next interview. Yeah, yeah, for yeah. sure. For sure. Alright, so. Yeah, I'm kind He's of. Like, Bye, everybody. Bye. Phil. Yeah. Thank you. I'm, I'm Thomas, by the way. Thank you. So, so Tabby's driving. I'm horrible at directions. The power. Mostly 95 North.